recording right now. Oh yeah, I just realized that's all on tape. That's great. Three, two, one, bro. Make it rain, son! Chips, oh, I made a mess, I made a mess. What's up everybody, my name is Michael Lee Murphy and I'm holding here a bunch of poker chips, uh, some for like wits and wagers, some that have our dice dudes on them, pow, like that, and it's got me thinking about money in games. I don't know if you noticed, but a lot of games have money in it. It's a big part of, of gaming, it's like you gotta buy this thing to trade that wheat, uh, and so I have I have realized that I've spent a good portion of time, and I'm not complaining about this, because punching out games is the best part of games. As soon as you finish punching out the game, it's like a car taking it off the lot, depreciates in value a little bit, and then you go on playing the game and loving it for the rest of your life, but there's nothing as sweet as punching out that game. But what I've realized I've done is I've punched out so much money. So many different types of money for every single game you play. There's just this money that money. This is called mega credits. This is called that, but it's just money, right? So I am curious, have you done yourself the favor of investing in some really sweet ass generic money for games? Because there's all sorts of like metal coins you can get upgrades for like scythe and things like that. And what I've heard is people say like, oh, I use my scythe coins for this game, that game, and that game because I really like the coins. And it's just money. It's, it's just one, three, five, ten, twenty. You know, it doesn't matter. It's not specific to scythe. It's not like there's a mech on there like Jamie Stegmeier's face or something like that. It's just money. Have you done this for yourself? We haven't. Uh, we pretty much just use the money that's with the game. We've upgraded like our coins and stuff for a handful of different games. But I realized like I could probably just invest one time, get something really super cool, and then just have it kind of on the shelf, ready to go for my money purposes in any game. Do you do this? Do you upgrade specific money for specific games like Libertalia, you wanna have things that look like doubloons or something like that? Or do you have a really solid set of money that kind of would work in many different themes of games and you just use that as your money or do you just use what comes in the game because it comes with it so there's no need to spend real money on fake money to play a board game i don't know the answer folks it's just something i got thinking about because it is so cool when you have like nice chunky heavy metal money coins you can be like ping and like throw money at your opponent and stuff you have to pay him for something. So I'm curious if you've done that for your gaming experience. Let me know in the comments below what you think about generic money or ways to upgrade your money handling in your board games. Speaking of upgrading board games, a great way to upgrade your gaming experience is to go to GameToppersLLC.com and think about getting a Game Topper from the man Berkey himself. He's always running deals out there for everybody and trying to make sure that everyone has access to a luxury gaming experience. Do check out GameToppersLLC.com for more information on getting yourself a Game Topper so that you don't have to spend like a bajillion dollars, you just spend like this many dollars. That's gonna be it for me, folks. Thank you so much, as always. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the Brothers Murph if you're new to us. Welcome, if you've been here for a long time, welcome back. And if you still don't know my name, I'm Mike. That's, I'm that one, that's me. And it doesn't really matter if you get our names right or wrong. We're just the Brothers Murph at the end of the day. This is Jeff Goldblum. Uh, just remember, folks, that whether or not you use your own sweet money, you play for blood, you play for whatever glory or honor, or if you just use like whatever cardboard tokens or God forbid paper money in a game, the more meta, the more better.